what's in the back. This is a dresser. This is instructions on how to build said dresser. Bradley, thank you for the TikToks. There's a lamp, there's a lint roller, and there's a fan. And that's what's in the back. <laughs> uh, no on the wall. There's nothing on the wall. There's nothing. Delusional. Delusional. Mm -mm -mm. I tell my mom about us. Oh my goodness. Uh, uh, uh. They keep saying, I know. I have not, I would tell people if I'd had work done and I have had work done, but not that kind of work. I've had work done to my lips before, but that was in 2017. I had lip fillers in 2017. They don't last forever. They're not permanent. So those are gone, but that's the only thing I've ever had done to me. So sorry, hate to burst your bubble. Um, Captain Marvel, yes. I can't even see some of these comments. Hold up, let me scroll up. Hey, Bradley! Thank you for the night little helmet thing. Thank you. Thank you, Mark, for the roses. Any tattoos? Yes, I have two tattoos. Uh, I cannot show said tattoos, though. Let me just uh, skirt and get this person out. Because we ain't going to have y'all getting scammed we ain't gonna have y'all getting hacked because somebody's saying that kind of stuff thank you for the rose thank you for the footballs bradley thank you for joining my team thank you um i forget what i was talking about before outfit of the day you're looking at it you're looking at that i love this shirt i wear this shirt i actually got this shirt at tj Maxx. steel it was like six bucks so best six dollars ever spent Thank you for the rose, Zay. Can I call you Zay? Like, just, or Z? I wanna call you Z, that sounds cool. My leggings, I honestly forget where they're from. I'm not gonna lie. I actually forget what the brand's called. Um, no, I don't follow any other sports but football and I don't even really follow college football. I just follow the NFL. Um, I would consider myself fairly knowledgeable about the NFL. I don't know everything there is to know, but I am a Cincinnati Bengals fan and I'm a Lions supporter, a Detroit Lions supporter. So, uh, love your cosplay. Thank you. I don't cosplay as much anymore, but go big. <laughs> I don't really follow college as much. Yeah, I do not think the NFL is staged. No, it's, it is not staged. <coughs> oh, wait, what? I don't have any kids, no. Thank you for the fire! I don't have, I, I mean, I do have a link for my fanatics, um, but I don't have it on hand. I also work with a bunch of other companies too, and I have links for like a bunch of companies, all NFL related. So if you're an NFL fan, I can probably get you discounts on majority of your stuff from these certain companies that I work with. Uh, <laughs> uh, the best Bengals fan out there. Thank you. I wouldn't say so myself, but thank you, Bradley. Thank you for the celebration. It's a party. Thank you for the celebration, Bradley. Thank you. Um, I think, I mean, I'm not butthurt. Are we talking about this past AFC championship? I think the Bengals played like, um, as a Bengals fan, as a Bengals fan, the, Bengal play, the Bengals played, sorry. I'm trying to word this so I don't sound rude. Um, the Bengals played very questionable at the first half of the AFC Championship. It was not good at all. Um, and that last penalty with um, uh, whatever, I gotta remember, I can't remember who it was, Bengals dude, but he touched Patrick Mahomes when he was out of bounds. You can't touch a quarterback when he's out of bounds. So that was a good call. You can't touch a quarterback when he's out of bounds. Who day? Who day? There's a bug on her desk. It's not a desk. Bradley, thank you for the hand heart. Thank you for the hand heart. 
No one ever say it. No, because I don't want to get canceled on. I don't want to be rude, especially to my own team. Mm, it wasn't, no. It wasn't Pratt. I know that for a fact. I know it wasn't Pratt. I can't remember who it was. I think it was Joseph. Was it Joseph? I think it was Joseph. I think. Mm -mm, mm -mm. It was Joseph. Okay, <laughs> it was Joseph. Oh um, yeah, he touched Patrick Mahomes when he went out of bounds and you can't do that. So that definitely was not uh, the reason why we lost the AFC Championship, but it definitely solidified it, in my opinion. Thank you, Anthony, for the roses. Thank 